Hi everybody. Sometimes whenever you're using digital images, you want them to be printed out a different color besides black and white. And I'm going to show you a couple of ways that you can do that using Adobe Photoshop Elements. So we'll go and we'll open up our image. The image I'm using today is one called The Tweet Life that will be available at schoolgofly.com on May 15th. It's a great journaling image, perfect for scrapbooking. So here's the image in black and white. I want this entire image to be pink. So you go up here to image, mode, and make sure that RGB color is selected. Once that's done, you can go over here to the right side of your screen. You'll see a little thing that says layers and then normal and then there's a little box right there. You click that to create a new layer and you make sure that your new layer is above your original layer. Then I can choose my fill bucket over here on the left choose the color that I want. In this case it's pink. And then I just click and fill my entire thing up a pink. Back over here to the right, this little box that says normal, you'll see an arrow. If you click that, you can scroll up and choose lighten. And ta-da! There's your image, all in pink. Super easy, super quick. I'm going to show you another way that you can do that. I'll delete this layer and here's my original image back in the black and white again. Again, you're going to make sure that you have image, mode, RGB color selected. And this time we're going to go over here and use this cool little tool called the magic wand. Click it and then I can come into my image and click on anything in my image that's black. And that creates these little squiggly lines around everything. Now you'll see this little box up here that says contiguous you want to make sure that this box is unchecked. Then we are going to go over here and select our fill bucket. Again I'm going to keep my color at pink and now I go into a black area and fill and that will create everything in my image pink. So that's two very simple ways that you can change the color of your image from black to any color that you want. But what if you wanted multiple colors in the same image? If I wanted my bird to be blue and my letters tweet life to be pink and the rest of my journaling to be black, I'm going to show you how you can do that too. So I'll close this and I'm going to reopen my image and here it is in the original black and white. Again you want to make sure you've got image mode RGB color selected. I'm going to select the magic wand tool and make sure that contiguous up here make sure that contiguous is unchecked. Now I can go in here and click on anything black just like we did before only instead of choosing the fill bucket this time I'm going to choose the paintbrush. And I want to paint my bird blue so I'm going to choose a pretty blue color for my bird. And now I just simply paint over the bird. I can get outside the lines on the white. It's not going to change the white. It's only going to change what's black. Fill your bird in with the color that you want him to be. And now I want my tweet life to be pink. So I'll choose a new color and I'll click in pink and I'll paint my words pink. Now at this point I can leave it like this and have my cloud journaling cloud to be black, my letters are pink, my bird is blue. And if I wanted to keep it like that, remember to save it, go to file and save it as a new name so that you don't mess up your original file. So this one you might just name it Tweet Life Colored. And you save it as a new one. I'm not going to do it right now because I'm not going to keep it. So I'll cancel out. But just remember to always save your original 
file in the black and white so that you don't lose your original. Anyway, I hope that's been helpful to you, and thanks for watching. Bye.